Don't you stand below? Behind the bus. What's he doing down there? Protest is up here. Well, this morning there's supposed to be a section 21 order. Of course. But we're not really going to. Your organisation supports these child abusers. Yeah, I'm just telling you now. Yeah, I understand, Gar. All right. So I'm here as a peaceful citizen. I'm not committing any crimes. I haven't harmed anybody, and I'm not doing damage to property. My statement's made. I'm not. I'm not having a reaction. I know. <laughs> but, uh, it's very intimidating when you see all these Gardaí protecting child abusers. It's disgusting. It's vile. There's not a man among you. Every one of you, cowards. Simple. Here's a little message for them. They had their day with me when I was a child. I give it back to them. Insanity at its best. Insanity. Not only were children given a life sentence into industrial schools and orphanages, when they were coming out the doors, they were putting them into mental institutions where they remain for the remainder of their lives. And you and I, people like us, paid for it through our taxes. An entire life we paid for to be locked up behind bars and treated in the most inhumane manner possible by then scumbags in there. I have every right to be ar angry, Garda. Every right. I'm not saying you aren't. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm, on a state, I'm staying a point. <laughs> I had a chat with you about this two weeks ago. Yeah. And you know my view on it. Yeah. So. Yeah. I know you, you, you have to be, you know, yeah. uh, uh, on the fence. Like, like you got to take orders from above. And That's unfortunately, it. these people above you are doing the same as what them people are in there are doing. Raping, murdering children. Well, uh, uh, as I said to you last time, I hope that that's not happening now. Oh, it is. Very much so, there. Very, very still much here. so. Still here, it's still happening. HSP, over 500 children missing within the system. Nobody knows where they are. Over 235 deaths. And let me tell you, Phil Garland came out of the Archdiocese of Dublin after writing child protection, where he went into the HSC. What's the cat? I haven't seen it in a while. Only after seeing it straight away. <laughs> we started off in a copy the last time. Oh, we, just, we were off duty then, we're on duty here. <laughs> we are in the dark. Though. We're enlightening you. Do you know what I mean? There's a bit of info there. Oh, we are. We are. <laughs> we've told you. I just told you. I was telling you about Phil Garland. Yeah. He went into the HSC in 2005. By 2010, this is a child protection vote. He's lost 400 children and over 200 dead. And he's supposed to be protecting children. He was a child. 2005? Yeah, 2010. They've got rid of him. A complete embarrassment to the abusers. He couldn't explain himself on the six o'clock news. He was a babbling idiot. Buzzwords he was coming out of. And Archbishop Dermot Martin employed him and then recommended him to the HSC. Who's running the HSC? Dermot Martin. It's a perfect day for setting yourself at peace. I guarantee you'll find the peace you need. Not necessarily all the same day, but come on in. You're joking, no, those people destroyed me as a child. I'm traumatised here, I and I still can't get any help in this country. There's no help in this country for survivors. There's still survivors in mental hospitals because of these people who were put in as children. Come on in, Yeah, right. Good luck. Bye. There's loads of mental institutions. Loads of them. I don't believe in invisible men or books by, written by men that apparently God wrote. So we won't go down that road.
want to get through to any person. That's, they just want confrontation. Whereas I prefer, we do not prefer it to sell, but have someone with decent knowledge in it. Sorry about that. Zain 7 7 8 